Okay, the 2.5 update has been out for a little while, and I've decided to, um, I think I'm gonna record, um, this one. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> that's what we're doing today. Before we do that though, uh, I haven't even test run Yai. I've done these ones because I wanted to finish them, but now this is my f first time ever touching Yai. I'm skipping her banner, but I just still want to see how she plays. Huh? Yeah, I don't think I could ever get used to her. At least for me personally. She's cool, but I don't think I could be used to her. <laughs> we cast a don't talk. Oh my gosh, she's gonna be in the Sia dub. Sorry. <laughs> I'll take it back after. <laughs> Yeah, we've heard it so many times. <laughs> Gather! I'm going in! Yeah, I don't know. What the fuck? Where are they coming from? Where where are you coming from? Torn to oblivion. Oh, hello. Shogun? Wait, no. Could also be A. Huh. Oh, it's you two. <laughs> it has been a long time. We have not seen each other since the resolution of the Tenryo Commission crisis. Yeah. Okay, sounds more like A. It is you, right? You sure made short work of them. That was amazing. But she's just a puppet? Precisely. According to the rules I designed for her, matters of this nature are to be delegated to the Tri Commission. Mm -hmm. But Rift Hounds attacking the sacred Sakura. It brings back bad memories of that terrible disaster. A disaster? Yeah, what disaster? Yes. Five hundred years ago, a great catastrophe befell Inazuma. Everything was engulfed in a pitch black fog, and monsters ravaged the land. Countless lives were lost, and this homeland that the people had worked so hard to build barely escaped being obliterated entirely. Mm. The monsters committed many atrocities on Inazuman soil, and the Rift Hounds were always their advance guard. Their duty was to tear open a passage through space with their claws and teeth, and then call in even more powerful beasts. Kaya Hmm. So you've heard of it, too. That's an episode of history that I am loath to recall. Taken. What we just saw was a samurai's memory that was buried in the land. The sacred Sakura can absorb and purify the filth in the ley lines. After the Rift Hounds attacked, some of this filth leaked out through the cracks in the trunk and formed a physical entity. Something seems wrong with A. Are you feeling okay? <clears throat> Why would you ask that? Well, usually you'd pull out your sword and swish! Vaporize them all in one go! No? You are unduly concerned. I'm simply conserving my energy. Hmm. Are you sure you're okay? Although I have some understanding of the situation already, it could take an unexpected turn at any time. The same light is leaking out again! Old man? Is he blind? <gasps> Furuyama? Is that you? Hmm? Almighty Shogun, what brings you back so soon? I thought you were off fighting a battle in a distant land. Hmm. Fighting a battle in a distant land? Sounds like this guy's talking about 500... Allow me to introduce Furuyama. He is a tea master and a member of my retinue. One thing she always says is, good things don't last forever. Everything changes, fades, disappears completely over the passage of time. And so, P 
people must make the most of the life they have, seize the chance to enjoy it while it lasts, and have no regrets in the end. Your humble servant implores you, not with the war raging outside. This place is... complicated. It's quite unlike the tea house in your memories. Leave it to us. But... Well, okay. I never thought I'd see the day that I need the almighty Shogun to personally collect my tea set for me. I can't decide whether it's a final regret, or a final stroke of good fortune. <laughs> Exactly the most urgent thing to do right now, but at the same time, this lovely old man from 500 years ago has been through so much, and it makes Paimon so sad. In the vast majority of cases, the one he made tea for was uh, the former Raiden. Electro Archon, who was also my sister. So, are we Raiden gonna Makoto? Makoto, does that mean we're gonna fight her like? Ghost or so? Oh, I don't know. I an inkling about there being two Raiden Shoguns, but he always acted as if he was completely unaware of it. The philosophy of life that he shared with us just now, that was Makoto's view on reality. She always saw things that way. You and Makoto had pretty different views, huh? Yep. Indeed we did. It was the biggest difference between us. In her eyes, the most precious things in this world were dreams. Yeah, the yearning ambitious. for a better future held by living beings. Constantly generate new ambitions in the first place. It is something innate, rooted in instinct. In other words, it is something eternal. That's uh, quite a lot to take in. To put it simply, Makoto wasn't concerned about outcomes. I didn't understand at the time. How can we say that we are maintaining eternity when things are constantly moving forward and evolving? I suppose what it comes down to is the definition of eternity she set out with. Mm -hmm. Yes, it does. I always thought that she must have grasped some elusive, arcane wisdom to arrive at the conclusions she did. But in the last analysis, Makoto's philosophy was, on the surface at least, an elegantly simple one. Notwithstanding that it was also the more prudent choice, based on a more mature, far-sighted outlook. Do you feel you're starting to understand her better now? You have already witnessed my previous views on eternity. Yeah. But now, I no longer cling to what was lost. I suppose that means our differences have been reconciled. Almighty Shogun, <clears throat> I found a tea set. This one in particular should be fit for your- It's quite beautiful. Thank you. You are too caught. Woody? Or perhaps the ley lines did not have the power to sustain him for very long. As so so we won't get to drink his tea? We didn't even have a chance to say goodbye. The information held in the ley lines is complex and disorderly. The fact that we were able to meet him to begin with was a miracle of fate. Well, this chance won't come often, and we do have a tea set. Per I've watched oh, Furuyama brew tea on many occasions. I doubt I should have any major problems doing it myself. People, too. Kitsune Saigu, Makoto, and all the other friends who I watched pass oh. even further back. I remember, I think I remember Kitsune Saigu from Eyes, A's, A's, um trailer character trailer i remember i remember seeing one of them and i think i know which one it was i was like who's kitsune <laughs> i was trying to figure that out back at the yashiro commission 
I kept the conversation reasonably light-hearted. But now... I'd like to broach a heavier topic, if I may. Of course. The events of 500 years ago not only robbed me of my friend, Kitsune Saiku, they also took Makoto away from me. Mm -hmm. She died in that disaster too? Yes. She went to Konria alone. She went to Konria? Without telling me. Unlike me, Makoto was no martial artist. Whenever similar crises had arisen in the past, I was always the one to face them in her stead. But this time, the circumstances were so grave that Makoto had no choice but to leave me behind. Or... Perhaps it was more that she went ahead of me, put herself in front of me, so that I would remain hidden. In any case, by the time I realized what was happening, yes, it was too late. I arrived only in time to hear her dying breath. Oh, this is making me very sad now. She had already lapsed into unconsciousness by that point. So all I could do was enter into her mind. As far as you're concerned, it would be somewhere similar to the plane of Euthymia. It was there that we bid each other a final farewell. I cried bitterly. Even in those final moments, I couldn't understand her actions. Why did she go to Conria first, and not I? Why did she keep me in the dark about it? Was it to shield me? It was there and then that I resolved to pursue eternity. As a testament to that decision, I saved her realm of consciousness just before it collapsed completely and brought it back to Inazuma. That's quite a story. Yeah, it's, just, it's, it's so sad. When I returned to Inazuma, I was shocked to find that a great sakura tree had appeared on Mount Yogo, the tree that you know as the sacred sakura. Oops. That's exactly what everyone back then told me as well. That it had existed since time immemorial. They were so matter-of-fact about it, and couldn't at all understand what I was so surprised about. No one questioned it. And yet, its presence contrasted so starkly with the area as I remembered it. It seemed as if I was the only one to have noticed it appear suddenly out of thin air. In the end, I simply had to accept that it was a miraculous effect of Makoto's consciousness. Mm. With the help of the sacred Sakura's power, I was finally able to overcome the monsters and quell the disaster in Inazuma. This is all really hard to understand. Kinda beyond Paimon's level. It's okay, Paimon. Yes. She had such a great love for this land, and for its people. In this respect, I still do not compare to her. Now we're on the topic, since you experienced that battle in person... Brother? Hmm. I had heard that you were looking for your family. Mm -hmm. You mean to say that he was somehow involved in the Kamria disaster? Most likely. Based on what way. we've learned so far, it seems so, yeah. I'm sorry. I wasn't there for the whole thing. By the time I arrived, the worst of the fighting was already over. Oh, this is, I'm guessing maybe another Archon probably knows. Hmm. We'll have to see. And also... My mind was consumed entirely with the plight of Inazuma and the fate of those closest to me. Makes sense. So, I'm afraid I can't help you. It's okay. 
Oh, well, that's a shame. But it can't be helped, I guess. Boy, both of you have experienced great tragedy. With this last cup of tea, let us honor the tea master's memory. Thank you, Destiny, for giving us the chance to meet again. Also, I don't know. What the fuck? What the fuck? Are you alright? What the heck? I'm fine. I. Um... What the heck? What is this? Inazuma shines eternal. Hold it. What's happening? Is I o A okay? Hey, maybe you should leave this one to us. Yeah. Okay. I. Uh, uh, my apologies. Don't worry about it. Just take a breather. We'll deal with the months. Hmm? What's happening? Look, that's the same light again. Where am I? Who are you? Uh, Almighty Shogun, you're here too. Are you injured, Your Excellency? Uh, I'm quite all right. We, the Shogun at Samurai, will defend the Shogun until the very end. Come on, men. They're coming back for more. Don't. It's too dangerous. Guide you. Don't worry. I got, I got healing Atta if you guys boy. need it. Go. It seems like their attacks are finally over. <laughs> I've never fought so fiercely before. <laughs> Origins of this incident and tending to the root system. Alrighty then, let's move on. He looks calm on the outside, but Paimon bets her emotions must be all over the place right now, huh? Yep. She seems to have changed a lot since we last met her. Huh? What's wrong, eh? Come on, keep up. Uh, oh. uh, hey? What's going on? Are you feeling unwell again? Uh, my body. I can't move it. Uh, uh, it looks like the situation uh, is more serious than I thought. Uh, no need. She is calling me. Makoto? Should be nearby. Oh, there it is. That's a pretty entrance. The way that Whoa. appeared was very pretty. Where'd that Tori gate come from? Uh, it's getting worse again. But it's fine. I'm happy. I'm about to put an end to it all. <sighs> I'm happy. That this was a is a thing. place I once sealed off with my own hands. <sighs> the entrance to Raiden Makoto's realm of consciousness. Uh, it looks like she will no longer allow me to do with this body. As I please. Huh? What are you talking about? And who is she? Makoto? Ooh. Does look. Look! Look over there! It's another A! It's her twin. We meet again, traveler. Huh? Hmm? This body is an assistant to the one within. But it is also the guardian of the rules. You... Wait. Should the one within wish to stray from the rules, this body shall stand in her way. Wait! Paimon knows that voice! Is that... the puppet? Flow of time. 
only rules shall remain constant for eternity. Those were my thoughts when I created you. Now, they are towering obstacles that I have no choice but to overcome. Mm -hmm. You wish to make yourself my enemy? Oh. I am your past, the everlasting law, the guardian of eternity. And I am she who promised a dream to her subjects. Ride an A. Mm -hmm. In the end, even the proud oh. and mighty Oni Maiden was cut down and disgraced. Oh, oh my god, oh my god. The blade has been cleansed of her blood and filth. <laughs> Never shall it this shine as scary. brightly as it once did. This is scary. The music is so There's intense. No she has a shield? What the? She's cheating. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Wait, I'm, so, I'm too slow for this. Inferior. I will feed right into- I have tons of chicken. Don't think you can stop me, I have tons of chicken. I have tons of chicken, don't even touch me. <laughs> Absurd! There is no escape! Inazuma shines eternal! She's insulting me, I don't like this. Lightning falls on- No escape! The Kitsune and Sakura blossoms that once filled the skies fell to the ground as Just die, just die! As long as the ley lines oh flow, gosh. the relentless erosion of time with lightning that envelops all of Inazuma will fade that, silently how many into times? the clouds. How many times? There shall how never many? be another. Never. Oh my gosh, give me. For the rest of time. I, I need a break. I need a break. And Trust me. Now you shall perish. There we go. Oh my god. <sighs> Only emptiness awaits. <sighs> However long the battle may last, it is but a drop in the ocean of eternity. I vow to the subjects of Inazuma that I shall one day return. This is my oath. Please, be my witness. During my absence, I place everything in Miko's hands. Damn. But this means that- Pass on my words. I- A. Not I. I always say I, but it's A. Yeah. What if she gets too obsessed with winning, and she forgets why she's there in the first place? It could happen, and then she might never leave again. Yeah, we should help her out, like we did last time. The quicker she gets through this, the better. Is there any way we can cut down how long she needs to spend in there? Or, you know, help her win the fight? Mm. Well, whatever, we can't let anything bad happen to A while she's in there. Oh, but we also can't get in there anymore. Okay, well... Let's talk oh, to Miko on, probably. Wait, you still feel time on now? Um okay, maybe if we both ran into it at the same time really, really hard. G genius. Oh, you're right. Time <laughs> nearly forgot about her. Oh. Who knows if she really understands these consciousness realm playing thingies more than we do, but there's no one else we can turn to. Uh, Alright, up the mountain we go. <laughs> Be. Mm. Wait, I also wonder if this Raiden Shogun boss is going to be a uh, co-op or not. Hmm. Who knows? Hmm. We'll have to see. To the outsider, the realm of consciousness is a very abstract concept. Luckily, I'm A's familiar, so I can sense her rough whereabouts. In other words, even though I can't pinpoint the exact spatial location of this realm, I can still send you to where A is. Ooh. Okay. So, it's abstract, but it has a location, but you don't know where it is, but you can still send us there. What? <laughs> yes, no need to try and understand it. Let me put this simply. Right now, she is surrounded by chaos. Everything is turbulent and disordered. If you try to force your way in, you could be swept away by a giant wave that sets you down in an unknown corner of space-time. Oh. This is precisely why when entering the plane of Euthymia, it's much safer if you place your consciousness in a physical object first. Capable hands. For my sake and for Inazuma's, please. Bring her back. 
Yes. Nico, you better know what you're doing. That's enough chatter. Get to work. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Remember to focus constantly on your heartfelt wishes when you enter inside. Only if you are strong enough can I deliver you to the right destination. How can this be? You have returned. But how were you able to get back in? And how come you have not changed at all in all these years? All these years, what? This is a duel to remember. Years ago. What? Final duel? Huh. So you're finally willing to I think they're I think Raiden means Stand fight me. Stand back, traveler. I'm going to be the start of something new. The time our duels took to fight was long enough to witness the rise and fall of the nation. Uh, I didn't know this was going to happen. Energy what is happening? Great enough to vaporize the Don't worry, I still have chicken. You have nothing on chicken. Trust me. Sufficient to penetrate mines. I didn't think we we're gonna fight her with only A. This is scary. This is really scary. This is really scary. What is happening? I will endure forever. Chicken. Okay, there. I think we're doing okay. Maybe. Need one more chicken soon. Where's she going? What is happening? Oh! What's happening? What is happening? How do I avoid this? Do I jump? <laughs> More chicken. Huh. You're scary. <laughs> she's almost dead. I feel like she's gonna leave if I do now with the chicken. I'm gonna do this. Inazuma shines eternal. Shine down. Kill She's almost dead. Inferior. We won. Dog. <laughs> is beyond the limits of my understanding. This blade belonged to Makoto. Perhaps it can only respond to me with its full power when I truly understand and believe in her. <laughs> when I clasped Muso Ishin in my hands, I had mm. the feeling that she was by my side once again. No. It was at once a familiar feeling and a strange one. Makoto barely wielded a blade in her life. And yet, her blade brings me closer to her. You have my approval. Your present will is not the product of erosion. I shall no longer stop you from attempting to modify the rules. From this day forth, this body will remain your assistant. Hmm? What's that? Hello, A. 
<gasps> and greetings, those who have come to bear witness. Oh. I am Raiden Makoto, the previous Electro Archon, who failed in my duties and left you all to pick up the pieces. Makoto? Oh my goodness. I'm so happy. You've come so far. I always knew he would make it here in the end. I left a faint fragment of my will in Muso Ishin, so that in the moment that you unleashed its full power, I too would be released. Oh my gosh. <laughs> a convoluted way to reach you, but well, I'm tearing you up held such this deeply is so entrenched cute. views at the time that you wouldn't have listened to a word I said. There was no time to wait for you to have a change of heart. Please forgive me. All I could do was find some way to wait until you came to me. But... You never mentioned this to me. Everything happened so suddenly. I'm sorry. I've always felt terrible for having to entrust Inazuma to you all of a sudden. I should have been the one to impart these ideas to you, a little at a time, to dissuade you from your pursuit of stillness. Did you know what was about to happen in Conria? I had some sense of it. That place... was not somewhere that any Archon could afford to ignore. Do you think we can ask her a question, maybe? Hey, do you know anything about my brother? In my present form, I can no longer perceive time. I don't know how long we have been separated before this reunion. And I don't know what Inazuma has experienced in the meantime. But I know that this must have been an extremely arduous journey for you. And I'm sure you must have wanted to shed tears many times along the way. Don't look down on me. <laughs> it was with this possibility in mind that I left a parting gift for you. Something to soothe Inazuma's pain. Here, take it before my last shred of consciousness fades away. But it is you who must take the most important step. Wow. Huh? <gasps> the light turned into a seed? The miracle tree that blesses the people, in this moment new to the world and yet to be known. When to plant it, where it shall bloom, she who brings it into being must let her heart and dreams decide. Grant it life, eh? Is this... is it really? <sighs> Eternity extends time into infinity. Dreams illuminate each moment within. When both shine in unison, the sacred Sakura blooms from the darkness, finally free from the clutches of the heavenly principles. Now oh the God. nightmare has dissipated, and reality is made whole. The vision we both yearn for is still further ahead. My only regret is that I cannot witness Inazuma's future, nor can I walk this journey with you. Do you know, eh? I am so happy right now, because my final wish has now come true. Your polearm once protected me from countless calamities. For this, I've always felt indebted to you. Though I could never repay you in full, this sacred Sakura will buy you some time until you are ready to awaken and embrace the new. What do you think? Did it do the trick? <laughs> this time, it really is goodbye, eh? <sighs> goodbye, Makoto. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna quickly finish this up because I want to watch my friend's stream. Perhaps that is the reason why you were able to return precisely to this point in time without any problem. And yet... That sense of disorderliness has now completely disappeared. I don't fully understand yet. But my intuition tells me that the reason for everything 
It's that seed. Wow. Hmm. Well, I'm not convinced that it was Makoto's power alone. I know what you mean. Perhaps Makoto got a higher power involved in all of this. Is is I Staro? Oh, but whatever the explanation. Hmm. Boy, and the film. What was it? I ice ice rose ice rose ice. I don't know what it was, but I wonder what that that higher power was. It seems very interesting. Maybe we're probably gonna find out in the future. All thanks to her that Inazuma lived to see this day. I just planted a seed. Yeah, it was thanks to everything you did. Thank you. Today, at long last, you and Inazuma finally emerge from the shadows cast by the events of centuries past. Makoto and you are Inazuma's past and future, and both are indispensable. It's rare to hear such comforting words from- Oh, come on. You only think it's rare because you never used to listen to a <laughs> word I say. Makoto said the ex- <laughs> Great minds think alike, hmm? I wonder. Does that qualify me to, maybe, take the position of Shogun for a no. couple of days? Actually, no. Forget that. Far more trouble than it's worth. We will have to end the frivolities there. The Shogun and I will- After oh, that- <laughs> I will abolish the Sakoku decree. Yeah. Really? I thought it was already abolished, but I guess it's like officially no officially abolished now. I an eternity defined by stasis. In which case, there is no further need to keep the nation under- I don't doubt that many challenges lie ahead for Inazuma. I'm looking forward- Yay! Oh my gosh, that was a lot. They talk a lot. Oh, whoa. Many challenges still lie ahead Oh my gosh, okay. I'm not gonna look at those right now, but afterwards- That was beautiful. A lot to take in. We can unlock this though now. I'm not gonna I don't think I'm gonna record Miko's one, but yeah, this was very nice. I'm gonna look at what they have to say too and oh a new item. Cool. But yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed and that's it. Bye!